Uh, so hello viewers, welcome back to the channel. I hope you are all doing well. If it's your first time uh, coming to my channel and coming over across one of my videos, I uh, would ask you to subscribe if you like content like this about transcription websites, writing websites and different ways to earning uh, money online. And uh, so today's video, um, I will be comparing two online automatic transcription softwares. The one is Otter AI and uh, the other one is uh, Happy Scribe. Now I'm also aware that there is the uh, uh, Express Scribe software, which is this one here. Um, but uh, with Express Scribe, you will need to have a mic. Um, my mic doesn't get picked up by the software. Um, so uh, does a text does a speech to text uh, so you need your mic it works with your Microsoft uh, so it's a Microsoft built-in uh, features but uh, if if you don't if your mic also doesn't get picked up by Microsoft because it may be aftermarket um, then these two will be the, the best the best options for you to go to so uh, the first one here is uh, Auto AI. So what I've done is here I've got the transcribe me uh, one of the audio tests you need to do for for transcription. So uh, I'll be putting this up in the following video as well, so you guys can uh, do it properly. But for now, uh, this video will basically just go about how to use these two platforms and how to keep using the free subscription model. Because there is a way, if you stay tuned uh, during the video, I will, I will show you how to do it, how to stay on the free plan for as long as you like. It's really easy. Um, but also one more thing I want to bring to your attention is you need to get Grammarly. Grammarly helps those that type very fast. Now with typing fast, they also you leave a uh, room for a lot of mistakes. So Grammarly will automatically pick up that uh, grammatical errors, spelling errors, all of those sentence construction. But just make sure you do not uh, uh, break the guidelines of the audio you need to transcribe. Make sure it's still within the guidelines because Grammarly will want to make it perfect for you. Your transcription, your transcribed audio or text cannot be perfect. It needs to be as the guidelines set by the by the website or by the customer. So what we're going to do now is we're going to listen to these two audios. I've, I've uploaded the same audio to both of these. We are going to listen to it side by side. And I'll show you where a uh, few errors that both of these audios have, these uh, softwares have. They uh, they do pretty good job. They will save you a lot of typing time, but you need to be careful because they don't always uh, transcribe all the all the words properly. Because they because the software can only hear uh, as good as you in, in some cases. But, but but we have the added benefit of slowing down the audio and coming to our, our bit, better conclusions. And they the audio will just sometimes suggest words. The software will sometimes suggest words or just leave it out completely. So without further ado, let's go into Otter AI with the first first audio test here. Because all nations on the gold standard, uh, the gold standard is not a fixed exchange rate system. Because all nations on the gold standard use the same currency. They use the same commodity as money. What about paper currency? Bank notes and, and government issued notes under the gold standard were not money proper, but as I said, they were money, money substitutes. And they, they substituted for gold um, in exchange as warehouse receipts. So you were trading claims to gold. You didn't need to trade the physical gold. It gave you greater security. It was more convenient to, to carry around uh, claims to gold. It was simply a title that, that expressed the fact that you, you were the owner of the underlying asset or thing that was referred to. So let's look at some of these money substitutes. Prior to 19 1920, banks could not only issue checking deposits, but, but private commercial banks could also issue their own notes. So let's take one from the Farmers and Merchants National Bank of Los Angeles. Notice okay, so notice this one. It says Farmers and Merchants. Now, with the same, uh, with the uh, Happy Scribe, it's going to be uh, different uh, different words, and there's going to be a few other mistakes, but uh, let's just listen on to it. Let's just continue listening here for a says, while. It will pay to the bearer on demand twenty dollars. The twenty. 
Now, what's good to note is here that they make it twenty dollars, whereas uh, some of the others, like Happy Scribe, does not make it into a currency as it should be needed. The twenty dollars is that gold. The twenty dollars is that gold ounce that will be paid to you if you bring in for redemption that piece of paper. So people recognized it as what it was, and it was clear what it was, just by what was written on 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 the face of the note that it was a claim to gold. So also, one more important thing to know: it doesn't always repeat the status like the on on on. It just did the double one year in money money year, so it also makes it much easier for you guys. Well, let's talk about the connection between the gold standard and money and prices. So, when in redeeming twenty dollars for a gold ounce, they were not, as the monetarists claim, selling gold. They weren't selling gold to you. They were just fulfilling their contract. As as the monetarist claims, uh, we said we said with the S there. But uh, you can probably maybe leave that out, but I wouldn't. Um, so let's just continue. Actual obligation of redeeming that claim to gold. There was no sale involved here because you you can't you, you can't sell a claim against what it's claiming. That that's just that, that that's just a legal um, interaction. So in the long run, under a genuine gold standard, the, the money supply is strictly limited by gold mining, or or as we'll see more more strictly by the um, balance of payments for countries that that don't mine gold. You can only increase bank no bank notes and bank deposits. See uh. Yeah, it says don't mind. It's actually don't mind, but it says mind. Okay, so that's auto AI for you. I will have this uh, complete uh, transcribed text in, in the following video for you to watch more closely. Okay, so now we're going over to a happy scribe. So let's start with the happy scribe. Because all nations on the gold standard, uh, the gold standard is not a fixed exchange rate system. Because all nations on the gold standard use the same currency. They use the same commodity as money. What about paper currency? Bank notes and, and government issued notes under the gold standard were not money proper, but as I said, they were. So it's, it's supposed to be were not money proper, but it says we are not money proper. And it started a new sentence as well. But this is just the basic things that you need to look out for when, when using a prescribe and auto AI. So far, auto AI has been doing a much better job than a uh, prescribe. But it does differ with the quality of the audio for both of these. And both of these actually have their... Uh, their own benefits to it as you can see with the uh, happy scribe you can automatically add speakers when needed it also does very accurate timestamps down to the milliseconds but most of these uh, sites don't want you to put in the milliseconds just the basic seconds of it so this is also a great help for you that know that go transcript and transcribe me they want uh, you to timestamp every two minutes uh, sometimes so uh, that, that is also one good thing to note but if you can listen a uh, bit further, as I said, they were money, money substitutes. And they, they so it, here again was another uh, mistake. It's supposed to be money proper, but not money problem. So we can now, uh, I'm not sure about you, but I would use auto AI consistently. Uh, I would choose using auto AI over Episcribe. Episcribe is, does, they do give a better free trial than uh, auto AI, but I would rather use auto AI instead. Okay, so now if you want to download these, let's go right here and export the text. Okay, you can include speaker names, you can include timestamps, you can merge speaker segments and all of that. Okay, so that's what you can get with Auto AI. Now, as I mentioned before, when signing up with these two companies, you only really get a uh, trial version to to, uh, to to these online software. So what it what it what it basically means is you only get a few minutes of trans to free transcription before you need to uh, pay for it. But there is a way around it. Um, um, just listen closely. Um, you need to download the Tor browser. Now, what's nice about the Tor browser is that uh, Tor acts like a VPN. Um, let me just uh, show you an example. So, I'm not from the country where Tor is going to show I'm from. Okay, it's going to give a completely different IP address. Okay, so what is my IP? Okay. It is a bit slow because it goes through three nodes. It, uh, the traffic goes to, through three nodes. Okay, so uh, look at this. It says this is my IP, but it's not my IP address. Um, it also doesn't really give 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 a uh, location here. Okay, 
So uh, it's not going to be your IP address. So you can use Tor Browser to sign up to it, but you'll also need a secondary email. So what you're gonna need to do is you need to go to Yandex, okay, Yandex and then sign up for a free uh, email account at Yandex. So once you signed up for the free email account with Yandex, which is awesome because you do not need to use your phone number as with the Gmail, um, then you can sign up again to, to Otto AI or Episcribe, whichever one you want to use. Um, then you can just uh, transcribe the, the audio as you as you need it per, per the task as, uh, uh, as you were assigned. So um, I really hope this helps you guys out a lot. Uh, so my next video is going to be uh, sending you guys, it's going to be about, about uh, the, uh, the test, the audio tests at uh, Transcribe Me. And uh, also, I'm also done with the GMR test, um, which is this one here. GMR uh, transcription test. I need to upload the video as well, but I want to upload too much at one at, uh, at one stage. So you guys need to apply for the websites. Uh, I'll leave the, a link to the video below about the transcription sites. And you can click on it and see all the websites I show there and apply for them. And uh, some of the tests I do, here, some, some of the tests I'm not allowed to upload as they will take it down immediately. Um, yeah, so that's it. Um, so what I've done for you, I've put all the links in a uh, PDF file, which you can download. There's a link down in the description. The links are going to be to Otter AI, um, Happy Scribe, also um, Express Scribe, and Tor Browser, and Yandex. And then you guys can, uh, it's all, it's going to be all yours. So uh, you can download it, check it out, and uh, let me know what you think about. If, you, if this video has uh, helped you in any way, I would like you to give this video a big thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel and uh, good luck guys. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.